supporting the question motion story is by Michael Lucha, who I'm honored to read for, an eight-year-old who is a third grader and a member of New Life. Every Thursday throughout the summer at the Promenade Mall, there's a farmer's market. Vendors offer a variety of fresh produce and prepared foods as well as crafts. There is also live music and is always well attended. One of the booths sells roses made of birch wood. Two older ladies make them by hand in the flowers book reel and come in a variety of colors. Every Thursday night this past summer, Michael Mucha bought a dozen roses with his savings and chore money. Then he walked along the crowd looking for unsuspecting strangers to present a flower to. Most people were pleasantly surprised by this random act of kindness, and Michael experienced the joy of giving while seeing the delight on the faces of the recipients. He even received several hugs and a couple of warm conversations with grateful strangers who had just had their days up there. <coughs> Once the farmer's market ended, Michael wanted to find other ways to give. Realizing that he has an abundance of toys, and that the kids in the after-school program at his grade school have been playing with the same old toys for the past few years, he recently took two of his radio-controlled trucks to school and donated them to the program so that the kids who were there would have some nicer toys to play with. The gratitude from the teachers and the excitement on all the children's faces reinforced his decision to give. He is making a concerted effort to look for opportunities to be helpful in giving whenever he can, including saying hello to strangers, making new or shy students feel welcome and included, and setting a good example for others in school and on his baseball team. Michael is thankful to God for all that he has and realizes that Christ in motion in his life through how he uses and shares the many gifts God has given him with others. On the altar are some of those roses which Michael hopes to give away this morning to Sunday school students so they can give them to someone or to a stranger in the next week. Giving stuff away is a good feeling to experience and is an opportunity for Michael to be Christ in motion. Mutual was our Christ in motion story this morning. And Michael would buy these flowers in the summer and he would hand them out to strangers as a way to meet them and do something nice for them. That's how he's Christ in motion. He wants you to be a part of that. So after worship today, Ms. Wendy Smith is going to have all these flowers in the in the darkness after worship. So when you leave worship, here's what Michael would love for you to do. Here's what New Life would love for you to do. We want you to take that flower and give it to maybe like a neighbor or someone you don't know. I know you probably want to give it to your mom or your dad. That's awesome. But we want to encourage you to give it to someone you don't know, to brighten someone's day, to do something totally unexpected for someone as a way to love generously. And Michael's going to help you do that. So these will be in the back, in the narcotics, as you need worship. Grab one so you can brighten someone's day today. All righty? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Isn't it time to put your feet up? I'm still out here on the floor. 